Prime Minister Philip J. Pierre on Thursday accentuated the value of government processes and warned politicians against trying to be subject matter experts on everything. Addressing reporters, Pierre said his administration aims to be a government that follows procedure by letting the professionals do their jobs rather than micromanage. He contrasted that with what his aides view as past administrations, where unqualified elected officials build themselves as self-styled know-it-alls who oversimplified complex disciplines and issues that require the advice of trained experts in decision-making. You see, our government is a government of processes, you know, and, and this is what, you know, we, and it's difficult to understand processes, you understand, because what, you, what we've been used in St. Lucia is one man is an engineer, he's a doctor, He's a coin surveyor, he's a, he's a mechanic, he's a hospital administrator, he's everything one man. And that's, and that's a problem, you understand? And this is why we find ourselves in the situation that we find ourselves. Because we do not allow professionals to do their work. Of course we have issues, but professionals must be accountable. So what has happened is that politicians have tried their best to pretend that they have the answers to all the, the, the questions in in, 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 in not. So our government is a government of processes. The Prime Minister said politicians must remember that as elected officials, their roles are temporary and they serve at the behest of the public. He warned that the post of Prime Minister is not meant to be a permanent or inherited, arguing the head of government presides over state affairs, not rule. I want to tell to all budden politicians, those in my government, those who want to see government, that being in government, especially as a politician, is a temporary phenomenon. When, you, when you're in your father's business, you can inherit that. But you don't inherit governments. Governments are not left for you because you believe that it, 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 it's your place. People elect you. And I've been very, very fortunate. People have elected me six times to represent them. I will thank them profusely for that. I will never not have gratitude for the people of Cassius East who've elected me six times. My single greatest achievement in life was to be elected six times by the people of Cassius East. Pierre said ministers should focus on developing policy and making resources available rather than pretending to have all the answers themselves. He pledged to delegate where necessary and empower his cabinet members. It's not an I, not a me, me, me. It's a country. And this is what I try to do. I try to involve all my ministers. This morning you heard the Honorable Wayne Girard, who is a minister in the Minister of Finance. He's, he's out there working on the budget with me, doing what he has to do, seeing about his constituency. We have to develop this thing holistically. It can't be a one-man show. And this is the government, and I will not lead a one-man government. I have confidence in my cabinet. Each man and woman have their responsibilities which they have to follow. It's not a one-man show. Senior aides told News Force that the Prime Minister's respect for the process does not mean that he is not cognizant of the limits of expertise. They say experts offer essential insights, but effective governance relies on a delicate balance of knowledge, transparency, and democratic values. Chuakim Duplessis, HTS News Force.